Hello, Emily. Uh, we talked earlier today and I promised I would uh, record a video for you um, showing how to beat hydrophobia in Toxic. Um, so yeah, um, you told me that you have problem finding bots on the map. As you can see, there are like five bots in the match. And um, uh, if, so if, if that's truly a problem, I mean, finding bots, I can tell you that the place where they like to gather uh, eventually is the is like the, the the bottom part of the map the near the water tank and that's where I usually go when I want to find them uh, even if they're not there I will sometimes stay there and wait uh, wait for them to appear uh, and that's also where I always aim my um, redeemer or whatever it's called in toxic you know the super weapon I always aim it uh, at the water tank because there is a high probability that if I hit it, uh, uh, if the shot hits there, uh, it will score me a frag or two. Uh, also, well, <coughs> sorry, as you'll see, uh, I make plenty of mistakes uh, uh, in this match, so uh, it's not like I'm some super pro player. Uh, if I can do it, anyway, anyone can do it. So take a look, um, I picked up the Redeemer and I shot uh, at the water tank and get a frag. Yeah, it's, it's uh, even, even if you get just one, it, it's still something because uh, those bots in this level are still not top notch when it comes to their skill and aiming. They don't score frags that fast. So even if you can score a frag uh, every once in a while, it, there is a good chance it will put you in, uh, in the lead. Uh, okay, so a frag here. Um, now I'll try to score one with a sniper rifle. Fail miserably, probably. A miss, a miss, and a headshot. Okay. Uh, as far as weapons go, I I think it's best to use whatever you feel most comfortable with. Um, Probably the rocket launcher is the best one because, well, the, the bots like to flock together and if you can... Oh, that was nice. <laughs> uh, uh, if you can put a rocket uh, in a crowd, that will obviously uh, give you uh, a chance to score a few frags. So, yeah, as you can see, I'm, I'm dying fairly uh, often in this video, but still I'm in the lead. So, like I said, it's, it's just important to score a frag every now and then. Yeah, like now. Uh, the, the the video is is probably going to be around 5 minutes. Yeah, the violator is also a good weapon. Anything really, anything you feel comfortable with. Okay, so I can see right here that the redeemer, uh, oh, Hellraiser it's called, will spawn soon, so I decided to wait. And once again I'll uh, aim it uh, at the bottom of the map near the water tank. Boom, just like that. And and again I I, I scored a frag. Uh, it's 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 a good idea to w when you fire the, the Hellraiser, it's a good idea to, um, to go there quickly, I mean to the water tank, because even if you kill just one bot, uh, there's a good chance you injured uh, some of them. So you may uh, so you may go there and uh, try to finish him off with a rocket launcher or the weapon of your choice. I believe the frag limit on this map is uh, 20. So right now I'm at 12, 13, <clears throat> 7 frags left. And as you can see, there is uh, there is no weapon preference on my part. I mean, I just grab whatever guns the closest and and start to attack bots. I find the pistol uh, quite puzzling. I mean, whenever you score a hit, it says like 20 damage, which seems a lot. So it should theoretically be just five shots. But uh, sometimes it feels like you have to sh uh, you have to shoot a lot more. I don't know if it's about the bots having armor or what. But uh, yeah, the, the the numbers indicate uh, that the gun should be fairly powerful, but it does not feel uh, feel 
feel slow. And another Hellraiser has spawned, and once again we fire it at the water tank. Boom. Double kill. So yeah, here I decided to just drop and wait for the boss like I had told you earlier. But unfortunately I lack skill to actually <laughs> uh, get some frags. Uh, here I tried to grab the um, weapon amplifier but I failed miserably. Uh, but uh, it's, it's, uh, it's also a good item to have. If you see it spawned on those um, uh, crates, uh, be sure to get it. Combined with a fast firing weapon like a Violator, uh, it can work wonders. Speaking of Violator, the final score is hit. Okay, so yeah, l like I said, uh, focus on uh, shooting this uh, the, the Hellraiser weapon at the water tank and it should be enough.